You know, there's so many different aspects of cycling. We all have our own little pocket, whether you're a road biker or a mountain biker or riding uh, down to get your groceries. I, I think we all can come together on certain things, and that is safety and the rules of the roads and the need to promote that. I personally think that every child that finishes elementary school should have received education in cycling, know how to ride a bike and know the rules of the road. It costs less dollars per kilometer to build bike infrastructure. You can literally move more people with less pavement. And I think the government really should be motivated by this. It makes tax dollars go further by funding bike infrastructure. And what we've learned over the years, of course, good for health, good for the environment, good for local economy, and good return for investment. And so we know that with active transportation that people have the opportunity to kill two birds with one stone, that you can actually kind of go out and you can get to work and you can get your exercise at the same time. A national cycling strategy would also reduce greenhouse gases that contribute to climate change. And once again, the World Health Organization has called climate change the most significant public health threat in the 21st century. It is the least destructive investment Canada can make anywhere. You can go to the mountains from BC, you can go to the Lacloche Mountains that I see almost every day when I'm out on my ride, you can go to the plains. It's the least detrimental to the environment, which then leaves it for the next generations to follow and use. A national cycling strategy with a focus on separation from traffic and traffic calming measures will ensure that kids can be kids and it will make Canada a healthier, greener, and awesomer country in the process. Thank you. Every day, people of all ages, ethnicities, and abilities ride bikes for transportation, exercise, and fun. Because cycling isn't a partisan issue. It's a, it's, a, it's a Canadian issue, it's a global issue. It's about our children, it's our future, and it's something we all have in common, and we're united. 